And here we have Chris Allen, who has the son in cancer, known for being more conservative, reserved, a little bit self-defensive than some of the other signs. He also has Mercury in Cancer, known for being a good listener and, uh, you know, letting his feelings show a little bit more. Now, Chris has a third planet in Cancer, Mars. That's different. Uh, definitely more peacefully oriented, also very sexy. Venus is in Taurus. Now, seven out of the 13 finalists have Sun or Venus in Taurus. So that's a lot of Taurus. And he has uh, Venus square Jupiter. 12 out of 13 of the finalists have Jupiter as closely aspecting the Sun or Venus. They have big hearts, a great sense of humor, and very much are cheerfully loving to each other, which, you know, that's certainly how it looks on the show. It seems like they're a very good group. Unlike some of the rest, Chris has Saturn aspecting Venus, and that gives a much more defensive, protective feeling than the Jupiter. He never thinks he has enough self-discipline. Neptune opposition to Sun would indicate a dreamer, but also very artistically talented, as we see, also a very compassionate person. So, very self-protective Cancer, feeling-oriented, uh, with Venus in Taurus, that indicates, you know, a uh, very sensual guy. Mars in Cancer, sexy. So he's sensual and sexy as he appears. Jupiter square Venus, lucky, especially having to do with his artistic talent. But Saturn puts a crimp on some of that. Neptune opposition to Sun, definitely has the muse active.